Kunatori 5, also known as HTV-5, is the fifth flight of the H-2 transfer vehicle, an uncrewed cargo spacecraft launched to resupply the International Space Station. It was launched on August 19, 2015. Topic: Specifications. Major changes of Kunatori 5 from previous Kunatori are: Solar panels were reduced to 49 panels, down from HTV-1 and Kunatori 2's 57, Kunatori 3's 56, and Kunatori 4's 55, since the analysis of the data from previous missions showed that fewer panels were sufficient. A sensor mount outlet was added since Kunatori 4 at a place where previously occupied by a solar panel, and on Kunatori 5 it is used to attach an environment measurement equipment Kunatori Advanced Space Environment Research Equipment CASPA. Improvement of loading the cargo transfer bag allows the increased capacity maximum 242 CTBs compared to previous 230, and more late access cargo max 92 CTBs compared to previous 80. When approaching to ISS, previous missions were held at approach initiation AI point at 5 km behind the ISS for system checkout, but Kunatori 5 was changed to continue the approach without holding, to simplify the operation. Topic: Cargo. Kunatori 5 was planned to carry about 5.5 tons cargo, consisting of 4.5 t in the pressurized compartment and 1 t in the unpressurized compartment. Due primarily to the launch failure of SpaceX CRS-7, additional 0.2 tons were added as the late access cargo. Total cargo weight was 6,057 kg. Pressurized cargo include potable water, 600 liter, food, crew commodities, system components, and science experiment equipments. System components include UPA fluids control and pump assembly (FCPA), WPA multifiltration beds (WFB), a galley rack to be placed in Unity, and simplified aid for EVA rescue, safer. Science experiment equipments include Mouse Habitat Unit MHU, Electrostatic Levitation Furnace ELF, Multipurpose Small Payload Rack MSPR2, Exposed Experiment Handrail Attachment Mechanism XM2, Nanorax External Platform NREP, and CubeSats Serpens, S-Cube, 14 Flock 2B, AAUSAT5, and GOMX3. Unpressurized cargo consists of the Calorimetric Electron Telescope CALET. Originally a NASA unpressurized cargo was planned, but it was cancelled on departure from ISS. Unpressured cargo bay will carry multi-mission consolidated equipment MCE, superconducting submillimeter wave limb emission sounder SMILES, and a NASA experiment module space test program Houston 4 STPH4 to dispose by destructive re-entry to Earth atmosphere. Topic Operation Topic Launch and Rendezvous with the ISS It was originally planned for launch in 2014 but was later postponed due to delay in the construction and qualification testing of payload to fly on the capsule. In June 2015, it was scheduled to be launched at around 13:01 coordinated universal time on August 16, 2015, due to the bad weather forecast. On August 14, the launch was postponed to August 17, and then on August 16, it was postponed again to August 19. Kunatori 5 was successfully launched with AHI IB carrier rocket flying from Pad 2 of the Yoshinobu launch complex at Tanegashima at 11 hours 50 minutes and 49 seconds Coordinated Universal Time on 19 August 2015. Communication and three-axis attitude controls were established shortly after the launch. Phase maneuver was performed by 1925 Coordinated Universal Time on August 20, and the first height adjustment maneuver by 1755 Coordinated Universal Time on August 22. 
The second and third height adjustment maneuver were performed by 307 and 612 Coordinated Universal Time on August 24, respectively. The ISS's robotic arm SSRMS grappled Kunatori 5 at 10:29 Coordinated Universal Time on the 24th of August 2015, and fastened to ISS's CBM at 14:58 Coordinated Universal Time on the 24th of August 2015. All berthing operations were completed at 1728 Coordinated Universal Time on 24 August 2015. <laughs> Operation while berthed to ISS From 2:27 Coordinated Universal Time on August 25, the exposed pallet (EP), which is carrying CALET, was extracted from Kunatori 5's unpressurized logistics carrier (ULC) by the ground-controlled SSRMS and handed off to the Japanese Experiment Module Remote Manipulator System (JEMRMS), which is also remote-controlled from ground. The JEMRMS then attached the pallet to the GEM exposed facility (F). Later, at 14.29 Coordinated Universal Time on the same day, CALET was removed from the pallet and installed to the exposed facility by the JEMRMS. The ISS crew opened the hatch of the Kunotri's common berthing mechanism and entered to pressurized logistics carrier at 10.24 Coordinated Universal Time on 25 August 2015 and began transferring the cargo. Departure from ISS and re-entry to Earth atmosphere Kunatori 5 was unbathed from the CBM at 11.12, 28 September 2015 UTC by SSRMS robotic arm and moved to the release position. The first attempt of the release at 15.20 Coordinated Universal Time was aborted due to an anomaly of the SSRMS. After one ISS orbit, Kunatori 5 was released from the SSRMS at 16:53, the 28th of September 2015 UTC. Expedition 45 flight engineer Kimia Yui of JAXA, backed up by NASA flight engineer K. Jell Lindgren, commanded the SSRMS. After the orbit control maneuvers, Kunatori 5 re-entered to the Earth atmosphere over the Southern Pacific Ocean around 2033, 29 September 2015 UTC.